Did your homework? We did almost all of this in class. These three on, on your child's paper, it has numbers on them. I wrote on the, all the numbers before I ran the copy. I think on this one, we didn't do number 12. Almost done. Make sure your child finished that. And then the next page is like this one here, um, this one. And we did the first two together in class. So here's this one. Let me see if I can figure out how to use this because I can't email it to myself. I want to make it, no. Anyways, um, these are the steps. You start with A squared. Um, erase that. You start with A squared. Oh, this is awful. It's so big. I can't, for some reason, email it to myself. But anyways, it's A squared plus B squared. This is horrible. Um, this is A and B, by the way. Let me try to, that's A and that's B and U is C. So I'm going to do it on here. Um, do it on here. Put it on line paper. Um, so that was A squared plus B squared equals to C squared. They have to show all steps. They're allowed calculator. They have to show all steps. So A is 15 and B is 8. It doesn't matter which one is A and B anyways. 15 and 8. And C is that letter U equals to U squared. So 15 times 15 is 15 squared is 225 plus 8 squared which is 64 equals to U squared. You add that together you get 289 equals to u squared. I told the kids to Google calculator. So you go to Google and you Google calculator. C A O C U calculator. There's the calculator. This check it's the square root. So 289 square root. Uh oh Clear. We want to put the square root first. 289 equals 17. So our answer is 17. Um, the square root, the square root is 17 equals to u. So this side u is 17. Notice this is 8 and u is 17. Oh my goodness. Here's A is 4, B is 1. Next one. A is 4. So you do A squared plus B squared equals to C squared. 4 squared plus 1 squared equals, let's see what C is. C is letter T right there. Letter T. Okay. So T squared. So that's 16 plus 1 equals t squared. Well, let's use our calculator again. That's 17 equals to t squared. Take the square root. Square root of 17. Clear this out. Square root of 17 ret equals. Okay, you want to take, it says to the nearest tenth. So let's just take the hundredth part. So that's um, 412, right? 412, 4.12 equals to t. Well, 10th place, this is a 2. That 1 stays a 1. That is what t is equal to, 4.1. Make sure on the um, 
the worksheet that you go at the bottom and put T for 4.1. Right here, write the letter T. And U was 17. Letter U there. Okay? And then, um, and you do that for all the problems. Um, most students find this pretty easy. Again, this is a squared plus b squared, so it's 7 and 4. 4 is a, 7 is b. So you do a squared plus b squared. I told them in order for them to use calculator, they need to write all steps, including the formula. 4 squared plus 7 squared equals to c squared. 16 plus 49 equals c squared. Add that together. Um, 65 equals c squared, right? Yeah, that's 65. Take the square root, take the square root. Calculator, um, clear square root of 65 is take this number right there, 806, 8.06 equals to C, and this is 6, so that 0 becomes a 1, 8.1 equals to C. Oh no, what was C? What letter? Let's look at the problem. The letter was Oh, I did this one, U. The letter was U. Okay. This is letter U. I missed one here. The 2 and the 3. A, B is 2 and 3. Doesn't matter which one it's A and B. Okay? So you do a squared plus b squared equals c squared. That's basically the homework, all of it, okay? Just follow the steps. You should be fine.